The distance around a figure is known as the perimeter, and we can find the perimeter of a rectangle by using this formula right here. P equals 2 times the length plus 2 times the width. Now, generally when we're talking about a rectangle, the length is usually regarded as the longer of the two sets of sides, but not necessarily. It, it doesn't matter as long as we only use one of them once, or each of them once. So if we look at this first example here, we've got a rectangle with one side that is 17.3 feet, and we've got the width, or the other side, the shorter um, side, is 8.7 feet. So we're going to go ahead and fill that into our formula here. So we have P equals 2 times the length, which in this case is 17.3 feet, and then plus 2 times the width, and the width in this case is 8.7 feet. Okay, we filled in our values, so now we're just going to go ahead and uh, do some multiplication. Let me grab the calculator here. And uh, 2 times 17.3, 2 times 17.3, that gives us 34.6. We have 34.6 plus 2 times 8.7. Clear that. That is 17.4. answer which is plus 34.6 52 so the perimeter of this rectangle is 52 we look at the units on each of our um, distances and its feet so our perimeter is 52 feet Okay, now don't get confused. Sometimes people want to make that a squared. It's not. We're not talking about square units. We're just talking about a distance. And perimeter, one way we can help to remember that is rim. Right here, the middle letters. Think of the rim. The rim is around the outside edge. So if we would add up this length plus this length plus this length plus this length, it would give us 52 feet. So the perimeter of this one, let's write it right on top here, perimeter is 52 feet. Alright, let's take a look at the second example here. Again, going to use our same perimeter formula fill in the values. We have P equals 2 times the length, and in this case we have 21 inches, so 2 times 21 plus the width, 2 times the width in this case is 6 inches, so 2 times 6, multiply 2 times 21 is 42, and 2 times 6 is 12, then 42 plus 12 gives us 54. In this case we have inches is our units on both of them, so our answer is going to be 54 inches. Go ahead and write that on the top of here. Perimeter equals 54 inches.
Alright, inches. There we go. Okay, so remember, perimeter. Perimeter means the distance around a figure, and to find the perimeter of a rectangle, we use this formula, 2 times the length plus 2 times the width. That gives us our perimeter. And perimeter is always just in the units that we're given. It's not squared, not cubed. We're just talking about a distance.